ಚರಿ ಥೌರಂ ಪರೇಂ ವೇದ ಕಟ್ಪ ಅಯುಕ್ ಪು ನಿಪಾನ್ ಮಖಾಯ ಸಂಕ್ರೀತನ್ ಹೌಬ ಅಯುಕ್ ಪು ಮಾಪನ್ ಸೇವಾ ಫಂಗಜರಿ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ವಹೆಂಗಂ ಓಂಬಿ ನಲಿನಿ ದೇವಿ ಸಹಧರ್ಮನಿ ರಂಜಿತ್ ಕುಮಾರ್ ಮನಾವುಪ ನೀಮಾಯಿ ಮನಾವುಪ ನಿರಂಜಿತ್ ಮಚಾನುಪ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಇಂದಿವರ್ ಮಚಾನುಪ ಪ್ರಕಾಶ ರಾಯ್ ಸಂ ಮಯಾನುಪ ಅನಿಸ್ ಕುಮಾರ್ ಮಚಾನುಪ ಜೋಬೇಂದ್ರ ಮಚಾನುಪ ದನಿಯಲ್ ಮಚಾನುಪ ಬಿನು ಕುಮಾರಿ ಮನಾವುಪಿ ಉರ್ಮಿಲಾ ಮನಾವುಪಿ ಪ್ರೋಮಿಲಾ ಮನಾವುಪಿ ನಿರ್ಮಲಾ ಮಚಾನುಪಿ ದಿಂಪಲ್ ಮಮೌನುಪಿ ಬಿಸೋಯ ಮಮೌನುಪಿ ಡಾಕ್ಟರ್ ಸುನಂದ ಮಚಾನುಪಿ ತರುಣ್ ಕುಮಾರಿ ಮಮೌನುಪಿ ಉಷಾ ಕಿರಣ್ ಮಚಾನುಪಿ ದೀಪ್ತಿ ಮಚಾನುಪಿ ಹೆನರಿಕಾ ಮಸುನುಪಿ ಬ್ಲೇಸಿ ಮಸುನುಪಿ ಜೆರಿನಾ ಮಸುನುಪಿ ಸಗೋಲ್ಬನ್ ಸಯಾಂಗ್ ಪುಖ್ರಿ ಮಪಾಲ್ ಇಂಫಾಲ್ count down by election 2020 saitu lilo wangko wangjing tenta singha five assembly constituencies First the top news headlines PCC demands government doctor not governor doctor Najma Haptala to disqualify 12 MLAs JAC distressed over freeing of minor girl rape accused cop Minister Biren chairs COVID-19 situation review meeting at Reims. And CBI salutes rate residents of AG senior accountant officer. Good evening. I'm loving Rimai. Welcome to Times of Manipur Television English News at 6:30. As a responsible citizen, it is our duty to minimize the spread of coronavirus as much as possible. Wash your hands frequently with soap for at least 20 seconds. Using an alcohol-based sanitizer also helps keep the virus at bay. Avoid touching your eyes, nose and mouth. Avoid stepping out unless absolutely necessary. Always wear a mask before stepping out and even in your own home in the presence of outsiders as masks have been proven effective in containing the virus. Maintain a social distance of at least 2 meters in public places. Now let's take a look at the news in detail. Congress in Manipur has demanded the state governor Dr. Najma Haptala to disqualify as ma many as 12 MLAs who were appointed as parliamentary secretaries in Biran government. A team of Manipur Pradesh Congress Committee MPCC led by Congress Legislature Party CLP leader O Ibobi submitted to con representation to Dr. Najma Haptala at the Raj Bhavan today. The representation demands prompt disqualification of the former 12 parliamentary secretaries appointed by Nbiren headed government. It stated that, that these posts are office of profit. Congress Working Committee CWC member Gai Kangam, party MLAs K Megha Chandra, K Govindas, K H Lokeshwar and DD Thaisi were part of the PCC team. The present government since it came to power in 2017 has committed a series of wrongdoings, CLP leader and former chief minister O Ibobi told a press conference held later at the Congress Bhavan. 
He said the BJP-led government was formed by means of force. Ibobi went on to attack the Biran government, saying it was it has wasted time by scheduling the by-elections at the wrong time amid the COVID-19 pandemic, besides violating the COVID-19 protocols during election campaign. The three-time Congress chief minister also questioned the way in which a BJP candidate from Singhat constituency has won the seat uncontested. Parliamentary Secretary said, "Me amat ta ni daga nati ko, me tara ni thoi. Har payai, noi matam dadi Parliamentary Secretary hap. Yes, happy. Matam dudu ai ni jaya ba. Ai ni jaya drava le pak puna mak loi no hujikti state government da state legislature da empower ta udra ba. Parliamentary Secretary hap payaroi. Honourable MLA sing se office of profit le hen ba phang hen ba yaroi hai dona." India ada lebih state pun nama accordingly, eksi mai mai gi state assembly dah amend tau dulu. Parliamentary secretary apa je state government dah yadre masih happy sih na office of profit. Attract tau i hai na hati na kita macam tu dah sida hati je lebih naya. Madu ke sab saba evidence, documentary, prop mai am dengdu loin enclosed tau dulu. Mui sing sih disqualified tau gada bni hai dulu. Akui gubernur dah hujuk, saya memerintah mama pisang ni. Aduh nama si akui akang mahi legal expert sing saya tanya jargon ni akui nampisal mesti. Chini Inkol Village JAC against the minor rape victim demanded the authority to book the accused in the sexual assault of a minor girl on January 11 this year. The JAC urged the authority to punish the accused, who is a cop. They say that no action has been taken up despite filing an FIR against the accused cop under POKSO Act. President of NP Naga Union, Kashahung Bariam told media at Manipur Press Club that the incident occurred in January during Gangai celebration at Chini Inkol village. He expressed resentment over the inordinate delay in taking action against the accused who has been granted bail by the court. <laughs> Gang pi gang mai asida, mayam ke mamang dah eksad lokat pi dri pau ba. Ekoi impui naga union, impui naga students union, any organisation, beli dah labour organisation mayam nasu ekoi pulle hai raga. Asi asum aran thi dok dri pau ba. Government na asi matik sabah eksad lokat dri ba pau ba. Ekoi sab sabah, ekoi na tau gudah ba, thabak si tau thagani hai besi, phong dok sabah. Chief Minister Anne Biran today chaired a COVID-19 situation review meeting at RIMS Jubilee Hall today. He also interacted with doctors, nurses and staff of RIMS. Health advisor to the Chief Minister MLA Dr. S. Ranjan, Principal Secretary of Health Services Manipur, Director of RIMS Professor A. Santa, RIMS Medical Superintendent Professor C. H. Arun Kumar were also present during the review meeting. Chief Minister Biren said that without doctors, nurses and health workers, the fight against the COVID-19 pandemic is not possible. Commenting on BJP candidate G.S. Haupu being elected unopposed well ahead of the November 7 bypolls, the Chief Minister said that people have placed trust in the Bharatiya Janata Party BJP party. Sleuths of CBI Anti-Corruption Bureau ACB today raided the residence of a senior accountant officer of Accountant General AG at Sagoban Maynau Lerak in Imphal West. The raid at the residence of government officer Konjengbam Ibotem began early this morning. The raid was carried out under the supervision of ACB Superintendent of Police Kamrang. The raid came after receiving reliable information about possession of assets disproportionate to his known source of income. A large amount of cash, jewelry, Jewelries and documents were confiscated from his residence during the raid. 
Let's take a short break. Stay tuned for more updates. Saklon Ama Matam Kayagi Mamangdagi Miam Gi Thamui Bu Sumhattu Na Laak Laba Ama Di Ngasi So Adumak Miam Bu Pelhen Bangam Liba Lamda Masi Gi Saknai Raba Sai Sakpa Dinesh Sharma Laak Liba Oktober Gi Kun Mari Thang Zinu Mitki Numidang Pung Tarit Makhai Taba Matam Da Saklon Nama Da Poodu Na Laak Chara Gani Thoramasida Aikhoi Gi Number 7629-943-543 Da Kol Tau Biraktu Na Saruk Ya Biyo Ama Di Wari Watai Sanabata Na Tana Apaamba Isai Khan Biyo Phairel Thagi Lo Lamjingo Finance na COVID-19 na thoga liba khudong chadwa maya masi usiraga. Collateral security yauta na document ng chang-chang dana yam na koma mong da loan fangan jargani. Shahida sunatagi chadwa tarani thoi gi interest rate ta business loan, loan against property, vehicle loan, commercial equipment loan, commercial vehicle loan gi khudong chadwa pisari. Haan loan lawi kiwa singi suwa na gumakal gi loan asi lawi gi khudong chadwa pisagani. Ako pa morol gita mag contact to below. Lamjingo Finance na gamapal. Contact number 7085-831-502. Metroga 9862-629-399. Kezabatana nupiyogi singgalai tingni. Khoaidigi hena thawai na taza na kezabatana nupiyogi luhong na nupiyogi. Punsida, amuk tang thok peluhong bunuh mita, thawai na hek taza bermuhong tak ke naba, amadi, nomit asida thon naba, tongan tongan bapoloi get design kaya fang bida gani. Aku pemurul kita mau contact tau bidau, khois nam Priyananda, lain jam awang lekai near Mekola, contact number six nine zero nine six one zero nine three six. Al Hayat, the best halal restaurant in Manipur. Miam na pam na chanari ba Al Hayat restaurant ge. Haurapa matiyal kuding mag Red Delivery app ke kutang da order to bi raktu na. Yaam na lai na ahen ba charges yao da na isa isa gi yum da thilak na bagi kutong java bi jari. Ebo si download tau du na ebo si ki kutang da ngasi mag order tau bi yu. Chaan na thak na ba po lam sing khakta na ta na imung amada nong mar chang draba yaad raba grocery item kaya marum su na fang laba app ni. Ngasi mag download tau bi yu Red Delivery for you. Arambai 2020 da pangbiga da ba item sing. Groceries, electronic items, electric vehicle, organic vegetables, frozen items, baby care, household items, health and personal care, snacks and beverages, indigenous items, fresh fruits and much more. Mm. Yeah. See ya. Akwai mi kap tozu ke daro ke? Isa isa ki dargaro ba pot matza ang gisu duka na madong chang ama da suung pang da matam sumang hak chang su ba ba Seh, yum dapam dapam na apa yang boleh lain sih kau? Arah mai tunggu tunggu ya, download tau solo. Aduga, isari puri kau sih dana. Kau ram ban bazar dah lain, baru dukaan meyam seh. Ha pagi jalan seh. Bantah ranu, harus ikut download tau. Welcome back after the break. Minister of Social Welfare Corporation Mahud Okram Henry today inspected the Utlo Joint Farming Cum Pisciculture Cooperative Society at Utlo in Bishnupur District. RCS Registrar Corporation Valentina Arambam, IAS, and other officials accompanied the minister. O. Henry inspected the activities of the society and their income generation process. During the inspection visit, the minister said that the state will generate more income if all society groups work hard together. Former Union Minister and Chairman of the Society, T.H. Chaobao, who was present during the Minister's visit, said the fishes available in the state are sold at higher prices since their food is bought from the outside states. On the auspicious occasion of Durga Puja, Manipur Chief Minister Anbiran extended greetings to the people of Manipur. In his message, Anbiran stated that the festival of Durga Puja is celebrated with different themes in various parts of India as it signifies the triumph of righteousness over evil, besides reminding all of the power of ethical and moral behavior and the value system which are the bedrock of the society. A combined team of Mori Commando and 43 Assam Rifles arrested a cadre belonging to the band KYKL last night at Moray. Ningtojam Yaima Meite, aged 25 years, also known as Pureton, son of 
and a Muba Mayday of Lamshang Haurang Shabana Shaban Lekai, presently staying at Kurai Lerak Yengbom Lekai, was apprehended from a cemetery near Moray Gate No. 1 while trying to carry out illegal activities, police said. According to the police report, Yaima got training at Tanan in Myanmar. He currently holds the rank of corporal. He has been handed over to Moray Police Station. IMC Ward No. 1 Corporator Ji Gaidon Rongmei today inaugurated a public toilet constructed at Langol Tarung under the non-plan scheme. Corporator Ji Gaidon Rongmei appealed to all to maintain government laid down SOPs to fight the coronavirus pandemic. He further appealed to the people to maintain hygiene while using the public toilet. The number of coronavirus infections reported in a span of 24 hours remained below 60,000 for the fourth consecutive day yesterday as India's caseload went past 77 lakh while recoveries have crossed 68 lakh, according to data updated by the Union Health Ministry. A media report said the COVID-19 caseload mounted to 77 lakh 6,946 with 55,839 new infections being reported in a day while the deaths climbed to 1 lakh 16,616 with 702 more fatalities the data updated at 8 a.m. showed. A total of 68,74,518 people have recuperated from the disease so far pushing the national recovery rate to 89.20% while the case fatality rate stood at 1.51%. The active cases of coronavirus infection remained below 8 mark for the 8, 8 lakh for the 6th consecutive day. There are 7,15,812 active cases of coronavirus infection in the country which accounts for 9.29% of the total caseload, the data stated. On the global scale, India continues to report one of the lowest cases per million population. With consistently falling case fatality rate 1.51% presently, it also has one of the lowest COVID-19 mortality. Ministry of Health said in a tweet attaching pictures of two graphs, India has conducted at least India has conducted last five core samples testing in only 45 days, Lokesh Sharma, scientist and media coordinator at ICMR said. Manipur's COVID-19 total case tally has climbed to 16,621 in the last 24 hours after 339 new cases were reported. The fresh cases are from Imphal West, Imphal East, Taubal, Juribam, Ukrul, Chandel, Kakching, Tamenglong, Chua Chanpur, Tengnopal, Senapati and Bishnupur districts. In the last 24 hours, three persons, a 70-year-old woman from Bishnupur, a man aged 58 years from Nonei and another man aged 35 years from Bishnupur succumbed to coronavirus at Raj Medicity, Rims and Janims respectively. Meanwhile, a 22-year-old man from Chua Chanpur district died of the contagion at Janims at 7.15 a.m. today as per the COVID-19 Common Control Room. With this, the death toll rose to 128. Meanwhile, 196 persons were recuperated and discharged from various COVID care facilities yesterday. The active cases stand at 4,101, while the recoveries have reached 12,393. The recovery rate in the state was 74.56 percent as, as of this morning. Let's take another short break. Stay tuned. Siri Siri Gorachandraya Nama Youth Affairs and Sports Department Director Oinato Pubiramba, Dr. Konsam Siam Sundar, IAS Na, Ma Kinu Sizaraba Imung Manung, Sakai Natai Maruk Mapang Kwai Pumna Maputha Doklam Laga, Hau Kiba Tang Tara Mari, English Sengi Kun Yum Sakai Sanumita, Brindavan Prapti Oi Kray. Lakliba Tang Tara Mapanda, Asi Sanchoi Lokacharaga, Tang Kun Tarukta Jira Usob Den Tokle. Upalakya Sada Brahman Besnop Ahlaman Amadi Marumapang Kwai Pumna Makna Matam Chana Leng Biraktuna Hari Nam Shraban Tawbiranaba Patrana Nimantra Kachari Seba Pangzariba Konsam Kumar Singh Mapa Konsam Ongbi Jandavi Devi Mama Konsam Ongbi Dogja Ranjita Ajom Sradamini Konsam Ongbi Gita Devi Mataima Konsam Angelina Devi Machanupi Konsam Sarafina Devi Machanupi Rok Siros Konsam Machanupi Konsam Premananda Singh Mayamba Konsam Arian Singh Machanupa Robin Red Konsam Machanupa Thoram Pareng Ayupung Nipan Makhai Bekatpa Nung Thilpungahum Sankritan Doiba 
श्री श्री गौरचंद्राय नम अखोई पुनमुकोंब डॉक्टर वहेंबम इमोंजरब इमु मनु सगैनाई मरुम ख्वाई पुनमुथाद्लग ओक्टोबर की तंग तरह निथो इंग्ली कून मेरा की कून मंगा निपा निब नुमित बृंदावन प्राप्ति ओख्रे लाख ओक्टोबर की तंग कून मंगा इंग्ली कून मेरा की माप निपा नोमाइजिंग चीरा उत्सव दिन थोखे उपलक्षिद ब्राह्मण बैष्णव अहलम मरुम ख्वाई पुनमुना चाहना हरिनाम सरवन तौरब नोलुचरी थौरम परे वेट कटप अयुक् पुनमखाई संक्रीतन होब अयु पुमापन सेवा फंगजरीब डॉक्टर वहेंबम ओं नलिनी देवी सहधर्मनी रंजित कुमार मनाप निमाई मनाप निरंजित मचानुप डॉक्टर इंदिबर मचानुप प्रकाशोरासम मयानुप अनीस कुमार मचानुप जोबेंद्र मचानुप दनियल मचानुप बिनो कुमारी मनाप उर्मिला मनाप प्रोमिला मनाप निर्मला मचानुप दिपल ममोनुप बिशोया ममोनुप डॉक्टर सुनंद मचानुप तरुण कुमारी ममोनुप उषा किरण मचानुप दीप्ति मचानुप हेनरिका मसुनुप ब्लेसी मसुनुप जेरीना मसुनुप सगोलबन सयांग पुखरी मपाल इम्फा फरे तब दी नते को असेंब अना अपाब दरकार ग्रोसरी आइटम सिंह रेड डेलीवरी एप सिजन ऑर्डर तो तौर लो चाब रेस्टोरेंट की फूड पोरसु ओबर पे तो तौब लाइना पोत खुद डिस्काउंट पीबग लोना खुद तो इनाते यौर इसने रेड डेलीवरी फॉर यू Now enjoy 20% extra on Kangla popcorn, Kangla Milky Balls, and Kangla rings. Kangla. Kudong Java Lopiho Radian E Right Amadi State Bank of India ka punna kusam naraga India government ki makada Mudra Yojana scheme ki kuthang da thabak pangaujo ka singda senda lambi ke acho ba mating oina ba set milon fagat hanna ba loina na loan ki kudong Java pizari ahan ba miyo chama da akak na ba matam khara gi oina loan pizagani aku pamarol ki damak Radian E Right Head Office Sangai Pro Ningtham Kol Amasung Francis contact number 8257850421 Welcome back. Hayrok Higher Secondary School Principal L Jila today urged the Democratic Youth Front Hayrok constituency to come to his office to ascertain the truth surrounding the recent demolition of Hayrok Higher Secondary School building, saying they should not depend on media over the matter. Jila told media that the school building was demolished after obtaining due permission from the concerned ZEO and that all materials of the school building which can be reused have been kept properly. Kabui Union Manipur demanded Justice K H Nobin of Manipur High Court to review the order issued on October 13 last, asking to sanction the fund for organizing state-level Gangai Festival 2020 to one Jen Bung Kamson, a so-called organizer of the festival. Through a release, Kabui Union General Secretary mentioned that advocates B P Sahu and T H Vashum, as per the government directive, had earlier issued a sanction order to Kabui Union that organized. The state level Gangai 2020 on January 8 last at Suombong Kabui Kunjau. People's Democratic Alliance (PDA) is all set to dom- nominate party candidate for the forthcoming Autonomous District Council (ADC) election. PDA General Secretary Administration announced the decision during a function to felicitate. to facilitate leaders of Naga People's Front (NPP) who recently joined PDA. The event was held at. A community hall in Tangkul Avenue. PDA Vice President Administration Betun Tongsen, former NPP Ukru Unit President Mahira Raihing, and PDA members took part in the event. Speaking at the event, PDA General Secretary Administration the Blue Mahung said that the party has gained momentum since its inception in 2007. Adding that the party will continue to work for the welfare of the people, especially in the hills. Because the Qing Dynasty later came in, PDA will automatically champion the cause and grievances of the hill people. I mean, see, quite a lot of talk. Then, we have the political awareness. Purok piraga, state ki, district ki, national politics. 
Amadi global politics ta yam positively actively participate to bangam nana ba akoi mayam da lamjing na ba thawrang loina sajare ba che a mayam gi thong da sum lo thok chaning bani Vice Chairman of Bumanu Kangli Park Soraisam Sanjit today informed that due to the current COVID-19 pandemic situation across the globe including Manipur, the 288th commemoration of Puya Meitaba observance will be downsized. The event will be held in front of Kangla Uttara in Imphal on November 2 next, he informed. <laughs> Meanwhile, a Kom Loop Kangli Park has informed that this year, Mera Ho Chongba Festival will be a low-key affair in view of the prevailing COVID-19 pandemic crisis. Through a press release, a Kom Loop said it has been celebrating Mera Ho Chongba along with all ethnic groups in the state, marking the love and brotherhood of the hills and valleys of Manipur. He also appealed to the masses to support a Kom Loop in organizing the festival this year. Relief Committee Against COVID-19 Herok Kendra today distributed relief materials to the residents of Herok Nagar Panchayat Ward No. 1 and 2 declared as containment zone. The items were distributed under the supervision of Herok MLA Tokchom Radesham with the assistance of councillors of the wards and volunteers of local clubs. Moirang Tem Tomba, a member of the Relief Committee, said that distribution of the relief materials under MLA Radesham will continue in the containment zone. Tomba also urged the people to follow COVID-19 SOP. A blessing ceremony for the 13th Shangshuk DCC intending candidate, A.S. Varingham Zimek, was organized today at the Ramvu Village Community Hall. Village authorities, including Hetman, attended the ceremony. Ramvu Shinao Long, Ramvu Katam Nao Long, Ramvu Youth Organization, Thinkers Forum Ramvu, and elders were present. The Ramvu Village authorities unanimously declared support for A.S. Varingham Zimek at the event. A one-day training come awareness program on disaster management with emphasis on COVID-19 was held at Kokcheng District DC office complex today. Department of Relief and Disaster Management Government of Manipur organized the program. Deputy Commissioner Kokcheng Kengu Zuringla, Relief and Disaster Management Deputy Secretary Aribam Shivadas and CMO Kokcheng Dr. P. Manihar attended the program. District Surveillance Officer COVID-19 Kokching, Dr. Kiran spoke on COVID-19, an overview and measures to combat the pandemic during the technical session of the program. Indian Red Cross Society's Dr. Ban Kim delivered a topic on cardiopulmonary res resuscitation, CPR and first aid while consultant of disaster management K. Chandra Kumar spoke on post-disaster and assessment PDNA. Sub-team commander of SDRF, Okram Achoba, along with the team, demonstrated firefighting tactics. DC Kengu Zuringla thanked the Department of Relief and Disaster Management for organizing such an important program. Disaster strikes our land is very important. We also know that this year 2020 has brought us to a domain where we have been left with a lot of challenges to face, especially, especially when the pandemic has occurred throughout the world. Any kind of calamities may have natural or may have may have not told to may have said. For you, height of the bill are there, and you give measures like the bill are there. No, 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 because you have COVID-19 pandemic scenario to the, I find that the court can do it, but can also say, can't come out and put on it. We'll be right back with more updates after a short break.
COVID-19 pandemic ki kal laba safo na school, college, coaching center ching ba sing thong no na khraba su. Isa isa ki yun da ning thi jana tamba ya raba. Ahan ba ki oina class 12 chemistry subject ki takpi tambi ba ki lamda saang na experience lai raba. Oza so na mani na putopi ba application nga si mak Google Play Store da chang bi do na download to bi. So na mani e-classes. Nang nabiti gilda masat pa daw. Isiyaw gina nang natahang bala ini. General Nursing and Midwifery GNM 3S course. Twelve pass in arts or science stream in confused to become a part of one of the most respectable professional career of all time. Twelve pass in above years in three years, six months. BSc in medical radiology and imaging technology DMRI. Ultrasound, MRI, CT scan, X-ray. BSc in medical laboratory technology. BSc in operation theater technology. Gitam University Bisaka Patnamda BSc Nursing Amadi MSc Nursing in NPCC Gitamak Female Amadi Mal Candidate Singna Admission Tobiba Yaragani Campus Manungda Masagi Hospital Lazaraba Medical College Ni Room Amada Mahiroy Ani Kaktamak Leba Live Facility Yaraba Amadi Yam Na Hygienic Oiraba Hostel Yaraba Kels Ni MSc Nursing Da Admission Panglaba Mahiroy Singda Tha Kudingi Stipend Oina Rupees 9000 Fangani Tuition Fee Structure BSc rupees forty thousand per year, food and accommodation rupees forty five thousand per year, first to fourth year same fees. MSc nursing in NPCC fees rupees one point five lakh per year, food and accommodation rupees forty five thousand per year. Eligibility BSc class twelve pass, physics, chemistry, biology and English fifty percent in aggregate. Manipur ki mahiroy singi wai na entrance test yaudana direct admission to bibay yagani sub na tagi sit tara mga khaktani. Aku pemarol kita mak kontak tau biro itu kira John near Bosem Babu Para. Kontak number six zero zero nine zero six two two six one Natraga eight seven nine four zero two six two seven seven. News in detail after the break. President of Lumding Educated Welfare Association, S. Ojit Singh, on behalf of the association today, thank Thaubal Superintendent of Police, Dr. S. Ibomcha, for his relentless efforts in the fight against drugs in the state. A press note stated that SP Dr. S. Ibomcha is one of the most eminent, efficient and dedicated police officers. President Ojit also thanked the police officer for saving many youngsters from drugs. Coalition Against Drugs and Alcohol, Kada, organized an awareness program on COVID-19 yesterday at Moirang Turenbal Lekai Mandob Ward No. 4 under Bishnupur District. The awareness program was conducted in collaboration with Progressive Youth Club PYC Moirang Turenbal, Turenbal Lekai Women's Development Association and Kada Bishnupur District Committee, a press release said today. As part of the John Andolan, Tegnopal District Police for the second time today organized the COVID-19 public awareness rally at different locations of border town Moray. Our correspondent reports, Tegnopal District Deputy Commissioner M. Raj Kumar and Superintendent of Police T.H. Vikramjit, Additional Superintendent of Police Operations M. Amit and other police officials took part in the rally. The NSC and IM has denied involvement in the ambush on Assam Rifles convoy in Tirap district of Arunachal Pradesh on Wednesday morning. An Assam Rifles Jawan was killed in the ambush. In a press statement, the group clarified that NSCN has nothing to do with the Arunachal Pradesh ambush incident that took place at a place near Sanilam village, Sanliam village in Tirap district. It is unfortunate that the media people simply gave report based on their own wild conjecture, blaming the NSCN. Such an unhealthy practice by the media to connect NSCN to the incident where one Assam Rifles Jawan died is highly dismissive. The clarification came following reports that the NSCN IM was illegitly behind the attack. So far, no group has claimed responsibility for the incident. It may be mentioned that the incident took place around 6.30 a.m. on Wednesday when a convoy of six Assam rifles came under heavy fire. In the firefight, one person of Assam rifles died while one sustained bullet injuries. The National Testing Agency, NTA, will conduct Joint Entrance Examination, JEE Main, in more regional languages for admission to the National Institutes of Technology, NITs, and other engineering colleges, Union Education Minister Ramesh Pokhriyal Nishnayak. 
Nishang said yesterday. The NDA conducted the entrance test in three languages this year, English, Hindi and Gujarati. Minister Nishang said that the examination will be conducted in the regional languages where entry to the state engineering colleges is decided based on examination conducted in language of the region. According to reports, the NTA will prepare a list of the regional languages for conduct of the JEE main based on consultation with the state. Let's take a look at the top news headlines once again. PCC demands Governor Dr. Najma Haptala to disqualify 12 MLAs. JAC distressed over freeing of minor girl rape accused corp. <music> Chief Minister Biran chairs COVID-19 situation review meeting at RIMS. CBI sleuths rate residents of AG Senior Accountant Officer. That is the end of the bulletin for the news at 6.30. Thank you for watching.